make sure everything's working, make sure everybody can hear everybody, that's <laughs> all those other fun things. System checks. I wish there were was a way to like do system ch do like a check on Twitch. Like everybody yeah. ready? Yeah, like just a Let's see here. Okay. Oh, like before the stream. Yeah, yeah like, like before the stream, sure. before you actually yeah, like, go live, because right, it could be like, oh, okay, yeah. so it's streaming and volumes working and yeah. we can hear each other. Yeah, that would be a handy feature, Twitch. Yeah. Yes. Get on it. <laughs> we know you're watching. Yeah, that's what we're here for. Give you ideas for you to steal. Enjoy. <laughs> <laughs> uh, let's see here. So everybody has their fractured power stone, correct? Oh, yeah, right. This wonderful <laughs> contraption. I forgot it was playing Chase for a second. Dun, 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 dun. <laughs> Here we go again. Welcome to hell. <laughs> <laughs> oh, playing Chase is wonderful. Uh, we only went to two planes the last time. <laughs> oh, really? Uh, and then the one plane we were on was just... I, I don't know why nobody wanted to leave, but I was like, okay. We were just vibing. <laughs> Just I was vibing like, out. I'm loving this place. I was like, this place is perfect for my deck. <laughs> <laughs> like, we can stay here all day long. Stencio is probably <laughs> one of my favorite places in here, just because every time a creature hits, you get a plus one, plus one counter. Love plus one, plus one counters. That's why I have all these dice. Or at least it gives me a reason to use all these dice. <laughs> <laughs> my friend uh, has parted with uh, her entire uh, uh, magic stuff. And she's been hoarding these huge click clacks, and I'm just so happy because no one wanted any of my friends, and she just gave them all yes. to me. I'm like, oh, yes! are they the ones from all the uh, the bundles? So they like, magic yeah, them? The, the, the beautiful. Big, the big... Yes, I love the I love the spin downs. <laughs> I'm just just so happy. They're wonderful. Lovely. And some of them are so cool, like the freaking Kaldheim one. Uh, that one is so awesome. I don't... This uh, the Midnight Hunt one has like it's glow in the dark, but then it also yeah, has glow in the dark so cool. speckles in it. Yeah, it's oh. really cool. Mm -hmm. So it's like a, a moonstone. <laughs> From they have there's a Zendikar, the new one, and twenty one. There's Kaldheim, Strixhaven. Which one is that? Oh, that's Crimson Bell. Nice. I like the crimson. I hate. That's oh, fire never mind. <laughs> <laughs> the black crimson bow one. There's one that's red. There was like two. Yeah. yeah there's two. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. Then I will say, it. whoever put <laughs> red ink on a red die yeah. shouldn't oh, yeah. be allowed to make dice. They this is the worst. Make any no, the one that Davy has. <laughs> yeah, there. the one I have. Oh, These okay. Were also those are very way sick. Like the Kamigawa ones. Mm -hmm. There's another Zendikar. What's that? Oh, yeah, these from Modern Horizon are really, really nice, oh, yeah. too. Those are the collector's ones. I yeah, think. I think there's three. Yeah, there's... Th oh, no, this one is Throne of Eldraine. And Throne of Eldraine again. Dominaria United? Isn't it this one? Uh, yes. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And... Uh... Ikoria. Corey, I was about to say, like, Behemoth. <laughs> <laughs> and Theros. Theros is one of my faves. Like, yeah, that one is really cool looking. Yeah. It's like a marbly look to it. I love it. Yeah. Hi, Spring Dweller. Hi, Sherry. So, anyway, that's, it. that's my new horde. And I'm a very <laughs> happy goblin now. I like them because a lot of times I have 20 counters on my creatures, so I get some <laughs> There we go. <laughs> Okay. Well, okay. yeah, I've been using D20s and trying to find the right number is actually frustrating. Oh, I need to get spin downs. It will yeah. drive you insane. <laughs> Especially if you have to do it more than just a one. <laughs> yeah. Like every turn. Yeah. Urza. <laughs> <laughs> so. I want to welcome everybody to my EDH Slugout, a little program where I play some magic with friends. We're going to be playing some plane chase today. Got some awesome guests with me. Uh, yeah, we're going to be playing some fun decks. Um, plane chase, if you do not know, is an alternate form of magic. Um, I've changed the rules slightly for EDH purposes. Um, 
we have this wonderful planar deck. The planar deck will decide where we are going. When the card is flipped over, that effect will take effect over the whole entire board, usually causing some kind of ridiculous thing to happen. Sometimes it's good, sometimes it's bad. Um, there's also a, another special section on it where we will roll this wonderful planar die. If the planar die rolls onto the chaos symbol, or the six on the die, it will make the other effect on the card go off, which is usually an ability that is kind of works with the plane, or works against the plane. <laughs> I don't know, sometimes sometimes it's really bad. Sometimes it'll like kill all your creatures, or kill everybody else's creatures, or won't let anybody attack, or the stupid stuff. So sometimes, yeah, you're going to want to leave. So when you want to leave, um, we get to roll this die for free once each turn. So if it's a plane you don't want to be on, you at least get to try to leave once a turn. Um, we also have these wonderful fractured power stones, which we will have in our command zone. Uh, we may cast them. They're basically 101 cards in our deck now because <laughs> this <laughs> once we uh, cast it, it will become an emblem and it will allow either to be used as a mana rock or you can use it at, to roll the planar die a second time. Um, the planar die can only be rolled as a sorcery, so just remember that. Um, yeah, this cannot be interacted with once it's out, just because, yeah. <laughs> Nothing good would come from it. Um, if anybody wants to roll their own die, you may, and we'll just use the one as the planar symbol, which will, if you hit that, go to a different plane, and if you hit a six or a 69, we will have that wonderful <laughs> effect happen. Um, okay, I'm going to let everybody introduce themselves. We're going to start with Davey. And, yeah, let us know what you're playing, where we can find you, throw your links up, and, yeah, and then we'll get going. <laughs> All right. Well, hi, everybody. Uh, I'm Davey. Uh, you can find me on Twitch or on Twitter at Davey F. Jones. I do some, uh, uh, some, uh, oh, my <laughs> It's been a big day. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> it's all good. <laughs> so I stream EDH uh, on Mondays and Fridays. Um, but, um, and I, I am also known for a uh, nice goblin for us. Uh, I'm part of the goblin community. And we had a lot of buzz. Love these. <laughs> and uh, tonight I am playing Cezanne, Perverter of Truth. So this is... Uh, uh, a, a draw and discard theme deck, um, so it, it will enable the, the other decks to go a little bit faster, or at least uh, help them hit their land drops if there is <laughs> if there is a god. Um, and there is some discard synergies in there as well, because eventually you're gonna have too many cards in hand, you know, you know? Uh, and you might lose some life, uh, maybe, uh, if you don't kill me first. Uh, <laughs> so, uh, so that's pretty much what you need to know. And um, hi, uh, the Spring Dweller, hi, nice to see you. <laughs> and uh, I'll, I'm, just, I'm just gonna pass it to my uh, friction brother in Christ, uh, Yogg. <laughs> Uh, thanks, Davey. Um, uh, yeah, everybody, I'm Yogg, or Yoggoth on Twitter and Twitch. I uh, mainly just do posting about magic on Twitter. That's where you can find me the most. Uh, today I will be playing Raphael uh, Fiendish Saver, which is, this is just going to be demons, devils, imps, and, and tieflings. A lot of my thoughts. So good just, stuff. just real hell, hellfire in a bottle here. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it goes. It. I haven't gotten to, around to actually updating my demon deck using him. He, he, I, I love making themes. Uh, themes are oh, the yeah. best. You gotta have a good, gotta have a good theme. I love a theme. Exactly. And Mitch, welcome. I back. do love a theme. Yes, the best. Welcome. Thank you for having me back, Amara. I'm so happy to be here. Hey, everybody. I am Mitch Completed. You can find me on Twitter at Mitch Completed, just doing Twitter stuff. Um, tonight, I am going to be playing Rakdos Vampires, piloted by Anya, Maid of Dishonor. The keyword in this deck, kitty! <laughs> keyword the keyword in this deck is, is kitty. each. 
It's a group slug deck. I want to hurt everybody equally all of the time, um, especially by taking advantage of Anya's ability to drain the table. Oh. <laughs> me and the dog are having a fight here. You <laughs> 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 won't let me have my seventh card. <laughs> no, stop. <laughs> I need my hands. I don't think I ever realized that Angie is each opponent. That's yeah, nice. yeah, that's really good. yeah. It's great. Yeah, that's actually yeah. <laughs> ah. Okay, tiny one. Uh, and <laughs> I tonight shall be playing my uh, new deck that I've been playing for like the last week. So I guess that's not too new. Um, Kamazar Servina Rain. She's a 40k Kamazar who uh, wants to basically. I want to put out as many creatures like as I can as fodder and just throw them at you. <laughs> <laughs> I have ways to keep them alive sometimes, sometimes I don't, sometimes I don't want them to stay alive. <laughs> but every time I attack, I'm basically going to be draining everybody at the table for the amount of creatures I'm attacking with. So the more creatures I have out, the worse it is for everybody. <laughs> she also has an ability that it lets me sacrifice creatures, because that's what commissars do in Warhammer. They want you to be more afraid of the commissar than you are of the creatures that you are fighting. <laughs> so the commissar <laughs> will just execute people at random and crap, so... <laughs> Brutal. To show that, Real. the Brutal. Yeah, some Orzov colors here. We can sacrifice creatures and gain life. Um, so <laughs> I'm basically just trying to go wide, or at least keep creatures out, <laughs> so I can keep doing that. <laughs> um, tiny one, I do need the whole entire <laughs> board, unfortunately, so... <laughs> I, How dare you? She's like, um, do you not know that I'm here? Oh. I have a, I have a big one here. <laughs> big one. Ozzy! <laughs> Let me see what we got going on here in this hand real quick. What is going on? Okay, I'm going to have to mulligan again, but let me, let me randomize us real quick. I've just been doing four is my, my number. I'll just keep with it. <laughs> It's a good it's number. Fine. It doesn't really matter, so... <laughs> yeah. It's... it's Commander. Who cares? Did anything move the first two times? Did you randomize the first two times? Yeah. <laughs> okay. No. Okay, so I'm just going to do it two more times, because... We're now back. I want to see a little movement. Yeah, like, I was like, <laughs> I don't think anything even moved. I was like, maybe I didn't even click the button. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm. It's been one of those days. Uh, let's see here. Let me maximize that real quick. I'm not starting, so that's good. So I can shuffle my deck. <laughs> but let us start out here. I'm going to flip the first card in the our first plane that we are going to, which is the Furnace Lair of New Phyrexia. Look, everybody. Nice! Yes. Phyrexian mm -hmm. Overlords! Woo! Oh, God, I'm gonna go hang with Chill Guy Urbras. Yeah, he's just hanging out. He just doesn't care. He's like, hey, everybody. <laughs> I imagine Urbras down in there just smoking a joint. Just Hell yeah. Chill as, he doesn't care. <laughs> um, anyway, <laughs> when you uh, planeswalk to the furnace lair or at the beginning of your upkeep, select target player at random. That player discards a card. If that player discards a land card this way, he or she loses three life. <laughs> And nice! So, so it begins! Uh -huh. <laughs> right. And Davey's like, this is the perfect place. Um, <laughs> whenever you roll a 69, you may destroy target non-land permanent. <laughs> oh, damn. 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 Oh my god. Murder! Not, not a happy place. <laughs> what? <laughs> or maybe it is the happyest place? <laughs> maybe the happiest place in Phyrexia. Uh, <laughs> let's go for that let's go for that yeah. <laughs> I always gotta pull these up so I can remember what all happens yeah Yeah. I'm just gonna keep saying wizards please make it so the cards come upright <laughs> okay so at the beginning of everybody's upkeep they choose a player at random and that player discards a card yep and wow. then okay all right well <laughs> we lose life I will uh, go ahead and start us off, I guess. Untap, yes. upkeep. I'm going to roll a d6, so we'll go clockwise. It'll be 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. 2. Yogg, sorry, bud. Uh, That's a terrible way to start the game. <laughs> I don't think the land. card is... Rant. No, oh, you just no. have to well, discard yeah, a card. Just a card, okay. Yeah. Well, at least 
least it's not random. Yeah. Ugh, that would be horrible. That is gonna. And it's to be only land, damage though. if you. All right. Well. At least that's your choice and not mine. Yeah. So you lose to three life. That's sad. Poof. <laughs> Big tears. Um, okay, and then I will draw for turn. Okay, so we're we're starting off like this, huh? Okay, I'm gonna play this Grave and Cairns and pass turn. Okay, upkeep. Uh, let me get a D6 here. We shall do the same. Mara, you'll be 1 2. Davy, 3 4. Mitch, 5 6. 2. That's gonna be Amara. No. <laughs> oh, I guess I should draw my hand. That's a good idea. Okay, okay. excellent. <laughs> Card to discard. <laughs> Like, Discard Furnace Lair. Uh, let's see. Get rid of that thing. Uh, how do I get rid of this? Okay. I guess I'm going to get rid of this uh, Deploy to the Front. Okay. And then... Did I draw? I have not drawn. Ugh, gross. I, like I will play a Luxury Suite. And I am going to roll the Planner die, <laughs> yes, please. please. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I mean, technically... It did land on this. Okay, is that the that's the plane's one? Yes. All right. It just cool. kind of slid. I, I accept it. I, I, I saw it. it. It's fine. Uh, God damn it! We're gonna go to the fourth sphere of Phyrexia. At the beginning of your upkeep, sacrifice a non-black creature. Whenever you roll the sixty-nine, create a two-two black zombie creature token. Oh, it's actually not too bad for me. I don't mind that. that. Yeah, that's not I terrible. have black creatures. <laughs> I have zombies okay, somewhere. I black creatures, so I guess that's not awful. I think we all do. <laughs> mm hmm. I like this layer. Okay, is it my turn? Yeah. Yeah, uh, I yeah think. Is, that's yeah. what I thought. <laughs> but I just realized that we, yeah. Well, Yogg had just moved to a different plane, so, yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, I'm going to play a Silver Flow of Campus, which is going to come into play tapped. And then I shall pass my turn. Alright, untap a B for draw. Um, I'm just going to do everyone a favor, and I'm going to drop an Urborg. Oh, Schwamps. Ooh. Schwamps. I am okay uh, uh, yeah, so everyone has swamps. And that's all I'm going to do. Pass. All right. Untap, upkeep, draw. Mm -hmm. I am that, going to. That's on upkeep we sacrifice. Yeah. Yep. Whenever. You, yeah. A non black. Oh, yeah. I should have tried to roll for 69, but. Oh. <laughs> Hi, Geek! Um, yeah. How are you? Actually, I will do this. I am going to play a Voldaren Estate. Nice. I'm going to filter into two and bring out my Power Stone. And, um... Yeah, sure, why not? Let's roll the die. Dun, 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 dun. Zombie. Oh, you're a zombie. Does that zombie have decayed? Uh, no, nope, it's no. just a normal zombie. Okay. Well, All it's right. a Phyrexian the, zombie, Decayed zombies, I don't think they were there in, in when Flame Chase was around, right? No. I don't think so. And they're probably Phyrexian zombies now. Yeah. Otherwise, probably. Yeah, because that wasn't a zombie uh, either. I will pass turn with that. I'm just getting my token. Cool. All right. Draw. Hmm. I do control a swamp because everything is a swamp. <laughs> uh, Tainted Peak. Success. Success. Uh, You're welcome. Two. I'm going to tap helping out. two. I'm doing my part. I'm going to play Body Dropper. I do like him. Right. This is uh, whenever I sacrifice another creature, put a one counter on it, and I can sacrifice another creature to give it menace. Hmm. All right. We're going to be here. Move it on. Your turn. Oh, I, yeah, no, I don't want to. I like this plan. I'm just staying here. 
guess I could have tried for a zombie, but I, that would risk yeah, leaving. <laughs> it might keep some creatures under control. Uh, let's see here. Let us play a command beacon, which is also a swamp. And let uh, do I just want to? Ugh. I do kind of want to play my fractured power stuff, but I also kind of want to have a creature out as well. <laughs> I'm gonna play everybody's new favorite assistant. Yes! Ooh, nice. Alice Very nice. Yeah. And core cleric, and they are a death toucher, a two-two. And whenever another creature enters the battlefield under your control, you gain one life. Whenever another creature you control dies, each opponent loses one life. And then I mm. shall. Eh, can't want zombies. Oh. Okay. Nothing. I shall Nothing. pass. All right. Hey, bye. No. Oh, thank you for the bits. You're awesome. Bio. You're all. I'll jump in war room. Bio's here. Hi, Bio. Um, so I'm going to drop a war room, which is also small. And I'm going to tap for two to get the fractured power stone. Nice. And before I forget, because I was forgetting about that. So thank you, Mitch, for reminding me. Uh-oh. Uh what did I do? Well, you play your uh, your uh, fractured power stone, so. <laughs> oh, <laughs> it is a mana rock. It is. Yes, and I'm starving for ramp right now. So let's go. I am done. All right, unsap. Does this one do stuff on upkeep? This the sacrifice a non-black creature, right? Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Okay. I don't have any of those, so nope. draw. <laughs> I don't plan to get any. Um. Okay, let's play a mountain and a tap for a total of four and bring in Anya. Anya. She's here and I get a blood token. And don't have any more mana, so I can't do that. Um, I'll just pass the turn. I like my Zombo. He can hang. Thanks. And uh, draw, play a swamp, and this is going to come in handy with all the sacking that happens. Mayhem Devil. Whenever a player sacrifices a permanent, Mayhem Devil deals one damage to any target. And um, actually it's going to be pretty good against Andrew as well. I'll just pass the turn. Oh, it's any permanent? Ew. Any yeah, permanent. Ew. <laughs> <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. He's so good. <laughs> oh, no. I'm going to play a command tower. And, ugh. That is gross. Um, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm going to tap three. I'm going to play an assault in intercessor. It's an Astrates warrior. It's another Warhammer card. It has First Strike and Menace. Um, whenever a creature an opponent controls dies, that player loses two life. Is <laughs> pretty, pretty awesome. That's um, going to be real tough against me. <laughs> and whenever another creature enters the battlefield under my control, I'm going to gain one life. So I will go to 41. And... Uh, da, 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 da. Everybody's got creatures except for Davy, but I feel be mean. I don't want to pick on Davy. Davy, I'm just gonna hit you for two. Just Me? Gonna, yeah, okay. yeah. No worries. And then I'll pass my turn. Well, actually, no. I'm gonna roll this dice. <gasps> hey, Ish. What's going on? Oh, Ish Melee. Oh, oh, we've got a raid. We've got a raid oh. from the from Lily. Hey, oh, hey, Lily, Lily raid. Oh, hi, Lily raid. What's your name? Defiant so we're going to draw our this. card. Oh, so much dark magic going on here. What? I know, <laughs> she's been called by all the Phyrexian and the black mana that we've been emanating from, you know, our energy and yep. everything. We summoned them. <laughs> we have summoned yeah. them here. spooky in here. <laughs> uh -huh. So I'm going to drop a Nykthos trying to Nyx, which is uh, also a swamp. And I'm going to tap for four. 
Um, using the Fractured Power Stone to drop a Nyx Lotus on the battlefield. So it enters tapped, and I can, uh, I, and then when uh, it untaps, you know, next turn, I can tap it, choose a color, and add an amount of mana of color equal to my devotion to that color. So of course I'm going to choose white. <laughs> right? That's how it works? That's exactly how that works. Uh, that seems sensible, yeah. Choose the wrong Thank color. you. That's what, right. what we asked. Right. <laughs> Feeling great. Okay, big, and I big thumbs up all around. Yeah, yes. Okay, <laughs> let's go, Mitch. It's your turn. <laughs> that is a lot right of mana producing that you just put out. <laughs> yes, but untap. with all the sacrificing that's gonna happen in this pod, I don't think I'm gonna have creatures sticking around much. So yeah. <laughs> Sacrifice? What? Here? No. No, there's no. That's. No black mana. Foolishness. Really. No sacrificing. Yeah. There's no creature dying synergies going on here. No, never. Um, uh, let's do chaos first. Let's roll the die. Oh, thank you for the follow, Woodland. Let's see here. Da -da -da -da. Chaos, chaos, no. chaos. Oh. Sean, oh, well. hi, Sean. I am going to. Um, I'll do that. Since all lands are also swamps, I will... You're welcome. Play, thank you. I will play the Seer Step Pathway for my lands. And then... I think I'm going to... Yeah. I am going to pay... I'm going to filter into Rakdos to play Knight's Whisper. Draw two cards, lose two life. One and two... And I will lose two life, and then I'm going to pay to sack this blood token and drain the sable for two. Yeah. Okay. And then that'll trigger Yogg's thing, I believe, Indeed, right? So, so everyone takes one. the damage. Okay. No, he chooses someone. I just right? choose. It's oh, you choose someone. A single, so I'll just bop you back. Gotcha. Fair <laughs> enough. Burp, burp. Hit um. <laughs> Go to combat step. How dare you retaliate? <laughs> no, I feel like it's good form to bop the host. Uh, Amara, what's your creature there? I can't click on it. I think oh, it's a Warhammer it card. A, yeah, it's an Assault and Intercessor. Um, it is a first strike menace with a, and it's 3-2. The 3-2? Cool. I'm going to swing a 4-5 at you. I will accept your 4 damage. <laughs> All right. And then I'll pass turn. That's command a two, huh? Ooh, I like that. All right. Um. So is that commander damage when she? Oh, it's just. Yeah, when she. Uh, like, not when she does the sacrifice. Okay. No, because she Ooh. does not do damage. You just lose two life. Okay. Mm -hmm. Excellent. It's also not combat damage. Uh, oh yeah, that's true. It has to be mm -hmm. combat damage. Alright, uh, I'm going to tap two, and I'm going to play my Fractured Power Stone. I don't have a uh, Power Stone token, so I'm going to take this Power Stone uh, token here, and I'm going to Fracture it live on stream. Whoa! <laughs> it is now a Fractured Power Stone. Um, I love it. Yeah, I just 30 bucks for that token. <laughs> yeah, hopefully this doesn't. Oh, that get was metal as fuck. <laughs> um, I could play this, but I um, am living. <laughs> uh, I could play that, but it would die because of the sack. Uh, I think I just have to pass the turn there. Okie dokie. Tap. Gonna draw for turn. want to do that. I'm going to play a ganja, a ganjo seat of the empire. Uh, it's just a plains right now. <laughs> Not doing anything interesting. Didn't really want to play it as a plains. Uh, guess we're going to tap this. And you know what? We do have death touch and first strike and menace. We have a lot of nasty stuff. Hmm. Nasty. One and two. 
And we're going to play some lightning creeps. Equipped creature is equipment. And the equipped creature has haste and shroud. And has an equip of zero. And then we're going to tap two more. And play our fractured power stone. Which can just hang out there for a second. And... Hmm. Mm -hmm. Gonna go to combat. I am going to have my Assault Intercessor go at Mitch. It has menace, so just run past your zombie. He's like, Rats. He's like, ah, it's, a, <laughs> it's a 3 2, correct? Yep, a 3 2. Okay. I'll take that 3. And then Davy. Actually, you know what? Hi! Hi, how are you? You. I'm great, and you? <laughs> I'm <pretty> great too. <laughs> uh, Do you want to give me some love? Is that what's uh, what, what's happening? <laughs> I think I'm gonna go and head over to, you know what, Yog? I don't know. I don't think you'll block. So I'm gonna come at you. Two two death touch. Mm. <laughs> mm. <laughs> I'm gonna call your bluff. You you're, you're called it well. Take two <laughs> Both those creatures are just too good. <laughs> ah, Geek yep. Beardly has redeemed a scry. <gasps> a scry. Yeah. Oh. Hi, useless knowledge. How are you? Oh, Thank you for that. That here, yeah, we're gonna keep that. Oh, and then draw a card. Oh wow, and Geek. Then draw. I will keep okay. it and then draw it. I'm gonna put that on the bottom. Fun. Damn. I'm gonna put that on the bottom. Thanks, Geek Beardly. Yeah, appreciate it. Oh, I will take that. Okay. That's good. I will accept this. Um, okay, I did play my land for a turn. Played everything, did my attacks. Gonna roll it to see if we can get off of this plane, because I would like to play other creatures. <laughs> I'm going to pass my turn. Alrighty, yeah. Creatures. Uh -huh. I know. I'm glad I had these Orzov creatures in here, otherwise I'd be in all sorts of trouble. <laughs> uh, drop a swap here. And let's bring out Saison. One, two, three, four, five. Saison is here. So um, with Saison on the field, at your upkeep, you lose two life and draw two cards, and then you can go to your draw step. So I'm going to make this little reminder text here for everyone. So yeah. total of three cards. Oh, hey, Alex. Alex is here! There's so many cool people in chat today. Yeah, that is They were all summoned here by our dark. I don't have a reliquary tower in here, y'all. <laughs> well, you should, Mitch! Come on! <laughs> Clearly. And uh, after that, I am extra done. <laughs> all right. Oh, no, wait, I wanted to roll the die. Go for it. Do it. And this dice sometimes it, sometimes it rolls and sometimes it's just like I run out the Alright, so untap and then in my upkeep I draw two cards and lose two life, is that right? Yep. Yes, upkeep draw lose two, two life, lose draw two. two cards. Okay, so I will lose two life and I will draw two and then draw for turn and I have so many cards. You're welcome. Uh yeah, totes. Um <laughs> Mitch is unsure. <laughs> He's like, this seems like it. This is like concern. <laughs> Much concern. They're like, mm, 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 mm. All right, I, I will. <laughs> well, I can get more. I'll, I'll play Shadow Blood Ridge as my land for turn, and then. Oh, yeah, I can only do so many things. Um. Two. I have six mana. Decanter of endless water, so that's pretty great. <laughs> Alright, so I'm going to tap in Seractos and a colorless and play a blood servitor. That's going to create a blood token off of itself. Um, it's just a 2 2 artifact creature, it doesn't do anything else. And then. Which one of you? You. 
Definitely you. I'm going to <laughs> tap one in Seractos and play a Restless Bloodseeker. It is a 1-3 vampire at the beginning of my end step. If I gain life this turn, I create a blood token. So, y'all are in luck because I don't have two mana to do that. Um, Davey, I really don't like you for doing that, so I'm going to swing a 4-5 vampire at you. I, I, what? I'm I, giving you more cards. Oh, wait, that's a 6-5. Wait, no, no, wait, can I take that back? That was a terrible decision. Thank you. <laughs> I didn't realize just how big Saison is. He said chunky, um, chunky boy. You know what, we have enough problems right now, and life totals are about equal, so I'm just going to pass the turn and hang. Cool. So we go to upkeep. Oh, wait, I got to discard some cards. Sorry. Two, three, four, five, Lose six, seven, two. eight, nine. Draw two, draw. All right, I gotta gain some. I still gotta start gaining some life here, otherwise I'm gonna expire. Post haste. What do we do? What do we do here? I don't know. Murder. 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 All right, we're gonna tap Parastone. Fractured Parastone, I should say. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Butcher of Malachary. Oh, is that the best way to do this? Uh, yeah. Damn, Hold Butcher of Malachary. Let me do some ma quick maths here. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm not your girl for that. <sighs> yeah, that's what we'll have to do this turn. Uh, five. Raphael. Raphael! Raphael. Yeah. So all my other demons, devils, imps, tieflings... Plus one, plus one, and half life link. So, Amara, do you have any creatures out? Uh, I do, but they are all tapped. They are all tapped. Okay. I think I want to do some damage. I will allow it. <laughs> uh, some damage. Some damage. I will just come at you with the mayhem devil, which is going to be a full foul. Oh my gosh. I don't like bigger mayhem devil. <laughs> I'll go to 31. And I gain four from the lifelink. Oh, two, no. three, four. They have lifelink, too? Mm -hmm. Yeah, Raphael gives them the oh, lifelink. Oh, that's bad. That's mm -hmm. a hot devil, honestly. Hot yeah. devil. I like Hell. devils because they have horns, and you can use the horns. For... Horny. Yeah. For Horny. Oh. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> hey, whoo, 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 this is a... What's this? What's the stream rated? All right, <laughs> I'm gonna pass to you. And Mark. <laughs> <laughs> I still have seven cards in hand. Okay. Draw for turn. Draw two, lose oh, two, and then no. draw for turn. I forgot about that. Uh, go to twenty nine, and then I'll draw another card. You know what? I do like cards, though. I know. That's that's why I'm giving you cards. I'm I'm you know I'm your fairy godmother, but I'm 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 your fairy god murder. Uh, <laughs> fairy god murder. Fairy god murder. <laughs> fairy god murder. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> Incredible. <laughs> Where was I going? Here? I forgot. What was I doing? Before I uh, drawing. Yes. This is where you were and, yes. and losing life. Yes, I and, did those uh, things. Um, I don't think I need, do I need, oh, I do need all that mana this turn. Fuck. Okay, I am going to play a Forbidden Orchard, which is a weird land that lets me add one mana of any color, but whenever I tap it for mana, target opponent creates a 1-1 one, one colorless spirit creature token. So, that's pretty cool for somebody, not me. Um, do I want to do that? Oh, that is a giant creature over there. Okay, I'm gonna tap. Hi. Yeah, there's a lot of big, scary creatures. I am gonna tap everything I got for six, and I'm gonna play Aetherios Shroud Veiled. It's indestructible, indestructible, <laughs> indestructible legendary enchantment creature. It's a god. Uh, as long as my devotion it's to a white god. Or, <laughs> are you a god? 
Um, anyway, um, <laughs> uh, if your devotion to white or black is less than seven, Aetherios is not a creature and will just be an enchantment. At the beginning of your int step, put a cow coin counter on another target creature. Um, whenever a creature with a coin counter on it dies or is put into exile, return that card to the battlefield under your control. Um, Aetherios is not currently a creature, so you're just gonna... They're just gonna hang, hang out in there. there. Yeah, just they are floating. Just, they're just floating around. Oh, also, who gets who gets the spirit oh, yeah. token? Uh, Davy, have a spirit. <gasps> I've got a spirit. Oh, I'm gonna yeah. have to suck it at my upkeep. <laughs> <laughs> yes, yes. <laughs> Probably. Ooh. Someone's gonna suck something, and the mayhem devil's going off. Yeah, and then when another, <laughs> whenever another creature you control, oh, uh, I control. Blah. <laughs> Wait, whenever a creature an opponent controls dies, that player loses two life. God dang it! I apologize. Oh, no. I forgot about that. That's how you're gonna get me. <laughs> yep, that's how I'm gonna get you. <laughs> I can't get past the giant headed, like, guar monster. <laughs> He's like 6'5. Terrifying. We all brought dirty decks. Yeah, we did. <laughs> <laughs> Treat aristocrat city up in here. Yep, this is how we roll. I'm gonna try to get out of the fourth sphere here. Okay. Yeah, please. Oh, yeah! Moving on. Yay! Oh, that looks less worse. Well, it looks way pleasanter. Artopolos. More pleasant. Artopolos? I was probably pronouncing that wrong. Uh, whenever you planeswalk to Artopolos, or at the beginning of your upkeep, put a scroll counter on Artopolos. When you gain life, then you gain life equal to the number of scroll counters on it. Uh, when it has ten or more uh, scroll counters on it, planeswalk. That's not okay. terrible. Okay. I like life. Alright, that's not like so bad. Life. Uh, whenever you roll a 69, put a scroll counter on Artopolos. Uh, then draw cards equal to the number of scroll counters on it. Okay. Damn. I oh my. Right. Oh no. I was going to say, why would I ever risk rolling? And then that last bit yeah. kind of eked in there. So we are going to Planeswalk here. <clears throat> oh, actually, we probably need a D10. But is it at your beginning of your upkeep, Amara, or everyone's um, upkeep? That it's we also can... when you plane yeah, step we, there, yeah. so when it happens. Or at the beginning, you gain life equals the number of scrolls counter on it. Yeah. So then... Yeah. So when it goes to your turn, it'll get one, and you'll la you'll gain two, and then I'll gain three, and then Yogg will mm. gain four, yeah, so and I'll we'll see if it gets to ten. I guess. Yeah. I, I'm gonna throw these light. I don't know why I didn't throw the lightning greaves on somebody just to protect them. <laughs> I have a response. Uh oh. Before you, yes. Um, I mean, I don't know if that's the right choice, but that's the choice I'm making because it. uh, it's gonna be difficult, I think, or maybe not. Maybe, or maybe not. Or maybe not. No, I'm. I'm. No, I'm never mind. Okay. Put your put your boots. Put your boots. You get to wear your boots. You get to wear your booties. Boots with the fur. The fur. Um. Boots with the fur. <laughs> Just your know, warhammer guy walking down with the fluffy boots. <laughs> yeah. Armored, fluffy armored boots. Uh, okay, I am going to end my turn. I do believe. All right. Which I'm going to put a coin counter on this creature right here. Mm -hmm. How about this? Yeah. Does it have to be... Oh, no. Another target creature. Cool. Yeah. So I'm going to draw two cards and, just... and then lose two life. And then gain and two then... life <laughs> as well. Oh, I've been exiled. Oh, no. I'm sorry. Oh, no. Okay. Sorry, everyone. Yeah. Okay, rejoin. Um... So, all right. So that's upkeep, upkeep. I also have to sacrifice a non-black creature. So that's that. I will uh, lose two life because of the Astartes uh, warrior. And then I get to draw my card for turn. So I'm going to play a basic swamp here. Um... I'm going to tap two. Uh, how do I do this the smart way? Uh, I'm going to tap two here and play a Jet Medallion. 
Um, so my black spells cost one less to play. And then I'm gonna tap... Uh, the next Lotus for two and that for three. And I'm gonna play a Sangromancer. So it is a 3-3 with flying, and whenever a creature an opponent control dies, I may gain 3 life, and whenever an opponent discards a card, I may gain 3 life. Hmm. Oh, I also forgot to gain the 2 life for the Arteropolis, right? Yep. So I'll gain that. Um, and then I can make 4 mana. I don't have any, really anything to do with that for mana, though. So I think I am gonna roll a planar die, just for funsies. See if we hit the the sixty nine. No, oh no! We <laughs> moving. Oh. Apparently we are leaving. Oh! How what? rude, Davy! Hey, man! I, I wanted healing. <laughs> Davy said, "No, nah, I got some healing. Let's get out of here." <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to go to the edge of Malakal. Um, if a creature you control would untap during your untap step, put two plus one plus one counters on it instead. Oh boy. It's so that it doesn't untap, but it gets counters. Yes, apparently. <laughs> uh, whenever you roll a 69, untap each creature you control. Okay. Um, okay, okay. Okay. Interesting. All right. Davy, you were passing, right? Oh, yeah, I'm done. Cool, just making sure. No um, worries. Okay. Gonna draw. Oh, wait. I'm gonna draw two. <laughs> lose lose two. two life, and then draw. Love uh, you! Yeah, huh? So many cards. No. <laughs> I like them all, is the problem. Alright, I'm going to play. Let's see, this is gonna, gonna go on here. This can go on here. So I don't remember what I can tap. We'll play a Sainted Peak. And then. Uh, as much as I wanna do that, I can't do that because I don't wanna discard that many cards. Okay. Two, four. Six, seven. All right, I am going to this over here. I'm going to filter into two to bring out a fire diamond. Oh yeah, the art is so cute on that. I love, love it. it. I want the whole set. I only yeah. have I have three out of five. Uh, ones, or do you just need normal ones? I can send you some. I have, uh, I have lots of copies. <laughs> I'm not particular, honestly. I just think the art's cool. Yeah. Mara um, being a true queen. As always. <laughs> as always. I'm gonna filter into another two and play a Voldaren Bloodcaster. That's gonna create a blood token off of Anya. Uh, it's a two-one with flying, and whenever a whenever this creature or another non-token creature I control dies, I create a blood token. And then whenever I create a blood token, if I have five, I can transform her. Don't ask me what the back does because I don't know off the top of my head. <laughs> um, stuff. <laughs> yeah. That's some stuff. Uh, I really just wanted to chill here and be cool, but with all this discard, I have to do things. So. I'm gonna play. I'm gonna pay a black and a red, and cast hungry for more. That's going to create a three-one black and red vampire creature token with trample, lifelink, and haste, and I sacrifice it at the next end step. And then this spell has flashback. Um, it's like me at a buffet. Just <laughs> Flashing back. Yeah, I'm leaving it everywhere because <laughs> I'm dropping it. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so that's everything I can play. One, two, three, four, five, six. At least I don't have to discard. I'm Woo! going to. I know, right? <laughs> um. 
Success. Oh. Yog, I'm actually going to send the three one with trample lifelink and haste at you. We do get to And then. Wait, sorry. We get to scry we have one. Scry. If you would like to scry. Oh, oh we, we have a scry. Yeah, if Thanks, you like to scry geek. Before your combat, you may. <laughs> oh, I'm keeping that. I'm bottoming um, it. Yeah, I'm gonna bottom. Thank you, geek. <laughs> I almost always do. Anyway, um, moving forward, I'm gonna send uh, the vampire and the two two blood servitor both at Yog. <laughs> okay, so the two two blood servitor. And the three one. Yep. And you're all tapped out. Uh, yes, I am tapped out. No, Anybody? no chicanery. No, no chicanery. That anything on board that could pop anything. All right. So Raphael is going to block the three, and okay. then the body chopper, which is a three three, is going to block the servitor. Cool. All right. So when the servitor dies, I will create a blood token off of Voldaren Bloodcaster, and, I will and lose then two life. and you will lose two life, Mitch. Unfortunately. Whenever another creature, or whenever a creature an opponent controls dies, that player loses two life. Over here. Oh, okay, but oh, then yeah, yeah. the vampire has life link, so I gain three life off of that. So I net one positive. Yeah. Correct. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Just cool. Make everything difficult. <laughs> That's more than zero. Okay. So then. Well, you have oh, two creatures well, dying, so you will lose four, but gain three, so you will still lose one life. Ah, uh, good point. All right, so I go down one total. Um. Beginning of my end step, I will sacrifice the vampire and be. Oh, I end up not gaining life this turn. Dress. <laughs> All right. Well, oh. such is life. Oh, you know what? Um, real quick, before we leave my turn, let's roll the die. Well, yes, you did gain life this turn because of uh of of the mm -hmm. the life link on your uh, on your thing, right? Well, I guess that would life. still count. I did technically gain counts. life this turn. Okay, yeah. <laughs> cool. Yeah. So I do I do get a blood token then. All right, I am done. Okay, cool. All righty. Uh, so my creature doesn't untap, but it gets counters, right? Yes, I guess two yes. plus one. Plus one. Okay. Okie dokie. Then I draw two cards. Then I lose Draw a card. Life. Everybody for... Geek Beardly Redeem draw a card. Then a draw a card. Oh, then a draw, draw another card. card. Oh my god, I have like 18 oh. cards in my hand. Yeah, that's how that feels. Land. Very <laughs> happy yeah. about that. Nice. I um, love chat chaos. Me too. <laughs> uh, Amara, how many creatures how many creatures do you have there? Uh, just two. Just two. Yeah, Aetheros is currently an enchantment. Mm, and I'm tired of that one and making me sack everything. <laughs> Or maybe we had to do something about that then. It has shroud. <laughs> I the, such things do not bother me. Um, <laughs> I try. <laughs> yeah, we just gotta we gotta get rid of that thing. Um. So first, we will tap two. We will terminate Ellis Accor. Unfortunately, Ellis Accord does have a coin counter on it. Oh, what does that mean? Um, because of Aetherios, uh, whenever a creature with a coin counter on it is dies or is put into exile, I return that card to the battlefield under my control. Is that okay? Okay, we're gonna have some stacky stuff here. That. <laughs> All right. Here's, here's what I'll do. Here's what I'll do. <clears throat> I'm gonna and, and, uh, I'm gonna tap four. I'm going to tap four. I'm going to play Chain Devil. Now with, I'll hold priority with Chain Devil on the stack. Does this work? Because, no, these four sacrifices, I mean, you can, but... So in response you... to the Chain Devil trigger... Okay. I would kill... Oh, but then the... Would then the coin trigger go onto the stack... And then Ellis would still come back anyway. Yes, because it, when it died, it had a coin counter on it, right? Right. But do you... You see what I'm saying? You see what I'm trying to get at here? Where I play the Chain Devil, I kill... The Ilkor. Forcing... So it'll come back before the Sack trigger. 
So you'll still have an, an option to sack Alice. Oh! But I could sack the other one. But you could sack yeah. the other one. <laughs> I was trying to essentially force the sack yeah. of the other. Yes, but if you kill Alice and then you play the Chain Devil, uh, she will have to sack the other one that bothers you. Right. And then oh, so the, the coin is at back of at the end of turn. Uh, yes. So uh, okay. Return that card to the battlefield. Yeah. So it's gonna come back, but she's but gonna have downtime. to sack. But she's gonna have to sack the other one that makes everybody lose two life. Perfect. So That's it depends on which one you want dead forever for now. I guess. Dead forever for now. So so we'll kill. <laughs> Sorry, I just had to do the right sequence there. Kill Ilkor, then play the Chain Devil, um, so everyone will uh, sacrifice a creature. I'll just sacrifice the Chain Devil. I'll sacrifice the zombie. Uh, then, uh, bloop, 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 bloop. I don't have anything to sack. Um, damn. Uh, I guess I'll sack the Sang Romancer. I'm gonna have a bunch of life that I'm gonna gain, so... So that'll be four Mayhem Devil Triggers and one Body Dropper Trigger. I am going to get rid of Elcor here. They are gone. That will... Everybody who no, lost one, a creature two, is going to lose two three. life. Oh, oh no. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to gain uh, three life per creature that you had that died. So I guess it's nine, right? And then I'm going to lose the two. So I'm going to go up to 41. No, doesn't Amara have to sacrifice the... Oh, I, you chose El Ellis. Yeah, so I, she died, the coin brought her back, and then I... Yeah. And then you sacrificed her. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Let me see... Okay. Um, so, who are you targeting with the uh, Mayhem Devil Triggers? Oh, yeah. Yeah, I got four um, Mayhem Devil Triggers to shoot somewhere. I mean, let's... you can choose my face. I just gained a bunch of life. Yeah, let's go four, Davy. That's going to net me back four because of the lifelink. Oh, you! Oh my god, that's such a cool interaction! <gasps> oh my god, I love this! <laughs> Yes, it's, it is very handy. Uh, Amara, you have that one creature, um, and Cezanne is a scary giant monster. He's a big boy. Just a little. Just a you, little. Your creature is a 3-3. Three, 3-2. Three. Uh, three, 3-2, two. Three, three, two, but first strike. Yeah. I will attack you with the body dropper, which is a 4-4. Four, four. Alright, then I will gain four life. The life link here, it's whew. Yeah. Uh would you roll the planner die for me, I would please? Love to. Nothing. I will tap my power stone to roll again. <sighs> Nothing. Alright, that's all I got. Your turn. Oh, I have to discard an immense amount of cards, let's see. <laughs> For all the cards, we appreciate it. You're welcome, and you got rid of my Sangromancer, so I, I don't gain any life on that uh, on that card uh, discarding here. Havoc, here. Jester. Uh, lose two life. Yeah. Draw two cards. Apparently, all my land is clustered together, which is gross. <laughs> Aww. I've, 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 the last five cards have been lands. <laughs> I'm like, what is going on? I don't want land. And then I will draw my card for the turn. Hey, Proxy Lab is here. <gasps> Proxy! Hello. Proxy! Hi, man! How are you? Let me call my dog real quick for you. <laughs> Uzzy! We have a ring! Three, four, and we can make swamps. And I do have pressure power stone. Okay. We have a ring! What do I want to do? I <gasps> Doggo! Doggo! Yay! Um, I was sleeping in bed, Mom, please. <laughs> like, do you not know what time it is? 
Oh, that's the new Whoa. card, right? New the card, new, new card. It is. Uh, it is a Phyrexian human with vigilance. It's a 5-5. Five, five. And as an additional cost to cast white permanent spells, I may pay two life. Those spells cost uh, one less planes, or one planes less to cast if you paid life this way. It seems, it, it's such a long way just to say, yeah, pay two life. Celebrity dreading <laughs> treat, Dogo. Woohoo! <laughs> You get treats. Uh, so Defiler Faith uh, also has an ability whenever you cast a white permanent spell. Uh, create a 1-1 one, one white soldier creature token, which is what this deck wants to do. Um, nice. Let's see here. Two, how much mana do we have left? Oh, you know what? We could do that. Okay. Yeah. I'm going to pay two life. And then I'm going to tab... This Forbidden Orchard. Who and gets the spirit? Yeah, who gets it? Yeah, who wants a spirit? Oh, Davy, you have some life now. Moo, 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 moo. Arrow, 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 arrow. Uh, I, did, I have a quick go back. Uh, I, I forgot my Raphael trigger because of my oh. Chain Devil. Is that all right if I put my little 1-1 one, one into play? Oh, yeah. Yeah. yeah, sure. Okay. No worries. You know what? I'm going to give it to Mitch. Oh, thanks. The 1-1 one, one spirit? You may have 1-1 one, one spirit. Cool. Let me go and get a 1-1 one, one spirit. And then I'm going to... I paid the 2 life, and then I'm tapping that for white. Tap this for black. And then I'm going to bring in Commissar Servina Rain. Using Phyrexian mana. That's right. <laughs> I am then going to move these fancy boots over to... The commas are. And then, what else do we want to do? She could attack this turn. Um, does she want? To, does she want to attack this turn though? Hmm. Not really. <laughs> uh, do I? Oh, if an Athreos is actually a creature now as well. Um. I think. I am going to go to the end of my turn, in which then I'm going to put a coin counter on my Assault Intercessor. How about that? And then I shall pass my turn. Alrighty, untap, upkeep, draw two, lose it. Two, and then draw my card for turn. Um, let's play a swamp. Mm. Uh, I'm gonna be a bit of a problem. <laughs> <laughs> Was that not already happening? <laughs> Maybe. Oh, no, we don't see my face. We just see my dog's butt. Yeah, it was like, it's just Ozzy's butt. <laughs> yes, so, um... I, I'm gonna tap for three. And, uh... Six life to play Kurik. Mm. <laughs> Yep. That is a real card. Yep, <laughs> that's a thing. <laughs> Hi. Um, so now I have a lot of devotion. <laughs> just a little bit. <laughs> just a little bit. Uh, so I am going to tap the uh, Nyx Lotus for... Uh, let me get an eight big chunky dice here. Um, for a one, two, uh, for five. Um, so I'm gonna use, um, uh, three of it, no, two of it, go to three, to play a Nighthawk Scavenger. 
So he's got flying, lifelink, and death touch, and his power is equal to 1 plus the number of card types among cards your opponent control in their graveyards, uh, essentially. And this guy gets buff. Let's put a 1-1 one, one here. Um, so let's just do the math for the graveyard when it's going to become relevant. Okay, that works. <laughs> Yeah. I have three types in mine. Cool. Cool. Um so I have three here. Uh let's use the power stone and one to tap the Nykthos for uh two for uh seven, so let's go up to nine. Um, I'm gonna use three of it to play a Fate Unraveler. So, this card reads, whenever an opponent draws a card, Fate Unraveler deals one damage to that player. Ooh, so, at your upkeep, you lose four, draw two, and then at your draw step, you lose one. So, every time you draw a card, you lose a life, so. Uh... That goes up here. Hmm. Oh boy. Fuck it, let's pull the plug. Um, <laughs> <laughs> let's make Amara not wanna invite me ever again. <laughs> um, one, two, three, four. Uh, for a Grey Merchant of Ashfidel. Oh, oh boy. <laughs> Damn. So devotion is now up to oh my god uh, one two three four five six seven eight nine ten so devotion is ten so everybody loses ten and I gain thirty. Oh, <laughs> Ooh. big space, big space coming out. Okay, yeah. Um, so 30, so I, I go to 59, right? Yep. <laughs> I think, that is yes. math, unfortunately. Uh, that so math this be guy math. Goes up. <laughs> yeah. This guy goes up, and, uh... Yeah! Um... Ooh, there you go. Um... <laughs> we have bored her. <laughs> No, I'm just so tired, gosh. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. Oh, no, no. Uh, I'm... With the rest of the mana, I'm gonna play a Rita Bone. So I'm gonna scry two and then draw two cards and lose two life. Uh, scry two, this, this, um... Eh. Bottom. And then I'm gonna draw two. Alright, I am down. <laughs> Uh, let's roll the dice. Okay. Let's roll the planar dice. Something really good. Oh, now. And, uh, I am sorry! <laughs> no, Pasta. don't apologize. Pasta tar I needed to, you know, to lower uh, Yogg's life a little bit, and it's our, uh, the only things I had were everyone, you know, everyone's included. <laughs> mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Okay, so untap, upkeep, I draw two, lose four. Four, correct? Yes. Okay, oh and then I draw for a turn and lose another one? Yeah. Okay. Got it. Oh boy, <laughs> this better be a good stack of cards, I yeah, swear. That's what I'm thinking. I'm like, I gotta have to draw some good stuff here next turn. <laughs> uh, oh. Oh. Um... <laughs> yeah, I I know nobody wants this, but I feel like it's the right thing to do. Maybe it'll change how things are going. I'm gonna tap for a red and blasphemous act. Oh, interesting. So thirteen damage to everything. Yep, thirteen damage to each creature. Soldier is gonna die. 
so everybody who is losing creatures is going to lose two life a creature. Mm. Oh no! <laughs> yeah. My oh, <laughs> hooray for things I didn't think about. You can't. You can take your take back counter if yeah. you want to. <laughs> I feel like I should because I think some. Well, no, that's. Amara well, I mean, how many die. creatures do you have? You have three, so you would well, lose six. I have lives. four. I'll lose four. eight. My creatures, I won't lose anything. <laughs> you oh, you won't lose yeah, anything. I, I okay. <laughs> yeah, but I'm basically taking myself out of this game. All right, I I'm gonna take that back if everybody's okay, okay with it because that's actually very foolish. Um, <laughs> I don't want to take myself out of the game. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> trying to take someone else out of the game. Um, Alright, I'm going to play a mountain for turn. I unfortunately have very little that I can do, so... Um, let's hop for a black and play an indulgent aristocrat. That's going to get me a blood token off Anya. That only triggers once per turn, so that's it for that. And then... I I two four six I have eight okay really need to put some smaller creatures in this deck <laughs> it's becoming problematic. Um, do to do, do okay I can. Which one's better? That's pretty much off the table. Okay. I'm going to tap for five. I'll just use that. And play. Wrath. Yeah. I'm going to play Falcon Wrath Celebrants. It's going to get me. They themselves create two blood tokens. So we'll go up to seven. Um, oh, um, I created a blood token, and I have at least five, so I transform Bloodcaster. What do you do on the back? Surprise! <laughs> Mystery guard! Three thief flying at the beginning. Oh, at the beginning of combat on my turn, up to one target blood token I control becomes a 2-2 two -two black bat with flying and haste. Neat. Um, it's not a may, but honestly, people, well... Davey, do you have any flyers? Yes, I have the Nighthawk scavenger. Okay. So that is only one. Hmm. Okay. Um, all right, at least I don't have to discard. I'm going to at least do what I came here to do. I'm going to pay two and drain the table for two. Yes! Don't do that. <laughs> ping! Uh, I will get a mayhem ping. I will da ping Davy for a one. Yes! And gain <laughs> one life. You should. Almost back to your starting total. Yeah. <laughs> and. Um, just to have a slightly better sized blocker up. I'm going to sack two blood tokens to transform Restless Blood Seeker. What do you do on the back? Davy, <laughs> you know the deal. Let's set up that two for you. Oh, it does the same thing, but I can also pay mana to drain the table. Five mana? Ew, that's obnoxious. Um, okay. Uh, I, I'm going to go to my combat step. One of my Things will become a bat, but I'm not going to declare any attackers. Um, let's roll a planar die before we leave my turn. Nope. Let's do it again. <laughs> roll again. Nope, we're leaving. Hey! We're going. If my creatures will get to untap. That's good. Something good happened to me, please. <laughs> we're going Nefalia. To yeah, Nefalia. At yeah. the beginning of your instep, put the top seven cards of your library into your graveyard, then return a <gasps> card at random from your graveyard to your hand. <laughs> no! <laughs> Whatever you roll a 69, return target card from your graveyard to your hand. <laughs> oh, 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 I hate this. Well, 
We go to my end step. So the top seven go in my graveyard? Yep. It's top seven, right? Okay, so we've got a mountain, haunted ridge, pointed discussion, charcoal diamonds, smoldering marsh. Hey, look, it's all my mana. Uh, Alluring suitor. One, two, three, four, five, six. And... Oh, there we go. Descent into Avernus. I'm going to put that in my hand, because that's the most fun card in this deck. And pass the turn. Wait, 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 it's, wait it's no. Random. Yeah. Then oh, it's at random. At oh, random I'm so sorry. From your graveyard. So it's from the entirety of your graveyard, not the seven cards. Oh, really? Yep. So then okay, so yeah. seven. Okay, all right, all right. So... I'm just going to mush these together a couple times. And also, we get to scry one when you're done. Okay. Oh. We'll grab that one, whatever that is. It's not descent, damn it. <laughs> and scry one. Uh, Thank you, Sher McMurr. I'm going to put that on the bottom. All right, and then real quick before we leave my turn, I think I have to discard a card. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yep. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and discard Blasphemous Act since it's only gonna get me killed and pass turn. I'm ready. I mean, if yep. you gain enough life, <laughs> it won't kill you. <laughs> <laughs> or if you kill okay, me, so I take five and one, two, three, four. Um, quick question, Mitch. When you sacrifice your blood tokens, did you... Oh, no, you sacrificed them to Anya's ability. Never mind. Um, okay. Uh, Davey, I think you were supposed to take two from the Mayhem Devil. Oh, me, I was taking two? Yeah. Okay. Uh, play a swan... Or a mountain... Did you forget to uh, draw two, lose four? And oh, then... I, I did. I did. <laughs> the terrible um, feeling. <laughs> oh, I got it. Uh, I'm going to tap five and play Conrad the Grim. Oh, oh no. <laughs> I hate every card at this table. It's wonderful. <laughs> I love every card at this table with Nefalia. We're going to die. <laughs> um, I think I'll just, I'll just tap three. Oh god, and throw my cards on the ground. And play a Rakdos Kirun. Um, yep, yeah, so I will just go to my end step here. Yeah, I think that's what I want to do, because I don't really want to do any attacks right now. Yeah, let's go man step in, mill seven cards. <laughs> Two, three, four, five, six, seven is zero creatures when in my the graveyard. My god! That was a my lot of lands. <laughs> but I do get to return one to my hand, I suppose. Oh my gosh, with Sir Conrad out in this place, right. this is horrible! Yeah. Yeah, it's ah, so bad. Ah. <laughs> I don't want to be here. Ah. Oh, so uh, I, I think you'll have to tell us if it's a creature. You don't have to show us, but if it's a creature, we'll, I, we'll have to lose. Oh, because it would leave the graveyard. No, it's just yeah. uh, it's just a, a mountain. Cool. And then let's see. Stuff's gonna have to go from my I hand. love Sir Conrad so dang much. <laughs> uh, I then I have to discard down, and that's just gonna be that mountain going back into the graveyard. Get out of here. Okay, so I'm gonna draw one, two, lose four. <laughs> four. And then I'm gonna draw again. And lose a life. And then lose a life. Okay, I don't like this. I don't <laughs> like this. Um, let's see here. And I just keep drawing more and more. Ugh, gross. I don't need more lands. I don't want more lands. I'm gonna play Tekken. I'm sorry. It's okay. I'm gonna play Takanuma, Abandon Mire. Uh, it's gonna come in as the Dust of the Swamp. Uh, how much mana do we have? Ugh. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then the Fractured Power Stone. Some eight we can make. 
that is not gonna keep us alive. <laughs> I know the feeling. Yeah, so, let's see here. I guess... Hmm. I guess I gotta be smart about this. No, if I die, all these creatures are gonna die, right? <laughs> More creatures I That's how any of this works. <laughs> if I just throw a whole bunch of creatures out. Um, I'm going to tap my Forbidden Orchard. I will give a spirit token to Mitch. Have a spirit token. Oh, thanks. Have another spirit token. Get another one. Yeah. And then I'm going to tap... Damn, Mitch is getting all the toys. Yeah. <laughs> You don't need any more toys right now. You have all the to the good stuff right now. <laughs> I like ghosts. I am gonna play. A I love ghosts. Visions of glory. It is a sorcery. I'm gonna create a one-one white human creature token for each creature I control. So I'm gonna create myself uh, five white creatures. Dang. So, and it also has a flashback and can be cast uh, where X. Or, bleh, this spell costs X less where, uh, to cast, where X is the greatest mana value of a commander you own on the battlefield, in the, or in the command zone. Um, so, I'm going to create some humans. They're just going to hang out here for a second, because they're not doing anything. Humans. Um... <laughs> question is, do I just attack? <laughs> Doesn't matter if I just attack and everything dies. Ugh. Ugh. Davy's wall of creatures. Everybody has a wall of creatures. Ugh. You know what? I have one, <laughs> two. I'm gonna sacrifice one of these humans. We got a raid! A raid! Hey, Jarvis. From Jarvis! Jarvis! Moonbeam! Jarvis Moonbeam is here! Jarvis Moonbeam, you say? <laughs> <laughs> this is a very evil pod. This is probably the most evil. <laughs> this is a despicable pod. <laughs> yes! <laughs> uh, I am sacrificing another creature. I'm sacrificing a human. Um, I'm gonna gain two life and draw a. Oh. Oh, uh, we're all we're gonna lose the uh, two life. Oh no, Alas is called Ilcor is dead. Yep. But Cut. whenever Conrad. you sacrifice another creature, you gain two life and draw a card. Okay, but Sir Conrad is gonna trigger it, though. Cool. And I get to Mayhem Devil. Yeah. How many did you sacrifice? Two? Just one. Just one. Just one. Okay. I will shoot the Mayhem Devil at Davy. Yes. <laughs> Makes sense. And I will gain one life. Success. We're doing it. Success. Dreamers MTG, thanks for the follow. Um, Dreamers, hi! Uh, this is so gross. I don't like this. Well, I... Let's find, let's find the world of bottle. Let's find. Okay, I'm gonna put a coin counter. I'm gonna go to the. Actually, no, what? I'm gonna try to get out of here because Sir Conrad can't kill you, me. There you go. Could be really bad. <laughs> no. Okay. No. That didn't work. Uh, rock, rock, power stone. <laughs> yeah. Last chance. We can do it. Oh, oh yes! Okay. Oh, where are we Can't going? Believe the it. die is good today. Yeah, where are we going? Yes. Oh, the pools of becoming. Mm. We're gonna go hang that out with peaceful. polos. Look at it. <laughs> and this must have been well. It, yeah. At the beginning of your instep, put that. Uh, put the cards in your hand on the bottom of your library in any order, then draw that many cards. Oh my God! You're gonna kill yourself. <laughs> <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> It's a face traveler! Oh. stinks. Whenever you roll a 69, reveal the top three cards of your planar deck. Uh, each of the revealed cards, 69 abilities trigger. <laughs> oh no. Then, Jeez. And then put the revealed cards on the bottom of your planar deck in any order. Just out of one fire, or out of the frying pan into the fire there. You thought you had escaped Sir yes. Conrad, but now are just going to get... Yes, so... Draw be... triggers to death. Oh, this stinks. Okay. Yep. I'm gonna die. <laughs> well, I mean, how many cards you got in hand? Um, 
Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, yeah, you're you're dead. <laughs> I was like, if she, if Emara's got like three cards in hand, it's not too bad, you know? Yeah, yeah, it's not too bad if I. Yeah, that didn't work. Okay, yep. I'm dead. Mm. <laughs> oh no! Now I'm in charge of plane or die rolling. <laughs> All right. Um. So it is my turn. Um. <laughs> Good luck, everyone. <laughs> yeah. Yes. We'll see. Uh, on top, upkeep, draw two, lose two because the this uh, fate unraveler does not touch me, and then draw my card for turn. I'm gonna play a swamp. Uh, and then I'm gonna tap one. Two and three to play <laughs> Crypt Guest. <laughs> Woohoo. Woohoo. What's going on, chat? <laughs> Hi Neo! Um okay, so now my my swamp steps tap for double. Um Heckin' scared uh, right now. Yes. So I'm gonna <laughs> tap <laughs> for Yes. I'm gonna tap for four here and I think I am going to extort it. Um I'm gonna play an underworld dreams. So whenever an opponent draws a card, underworld dreams deal one damage to that player. Okay, where are we at? So we're at uh uncalled for two damage per card draw. Or yeah. Yeah, yeah, you're at two damage for card draw, but your upkeep, you lose another two life. So now at your upkeep, you lose Draw two six, is six. And you lose six. And then you lose another two when you draw your card for turn. <laughs> I'm going down swinging, that's all I'm saying. And then... <laughs> I'm not going out quietly, that's, that's all I'm going to say. <clears throat> Yes, and then um, I'm going to tap the uh, Nyx. Uh, I did extort it, so y'all lose one and I gain two. Oh, okay. Then I'm going to tap the Nyx Lotus for three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen black mana. I'm probably not going to use the, all that mana, but uh, we'll see. So fourteen black. Um, I'm gonna use four of it, go down a ten to play Archfiend of Depravity. So it's a five five four with flying. At the beginning of each opponent's end step, that player chooses up to two creatures he or she controls, then sacrifices the rest. Oh. Wait, how many? You keep two creatures, you sack the rest. No! <laughs> Oh no! I'm abusing of Yogg's <laughs> Sir Conrad here. <laughs> oh no! I'm uh, evil. <laughs> evil. I just wanted to get to my next turn. All right. <laughs> You're gonna get to your next yourself. turn. You're gonna get to your next turn. It has. It is at your end step. Oh okay. So you get I your mean... full turn with your creatures. Oh. Okay, great, perfect, yeah, cool. It's at your That's all I need. It's not awesome, at mine, you. it's at yours. <laughs> Got it. Uh, I'm gonna use two mana to Grim Tutor, so I'm gonna lose three life and look for something in my deck. Oh man, I just opened my deck on Gix. Oh, nice. <laughs> Gix. Oh my god, the finest man on earth. Uh, except <laughs> after Neo, you know. Um... <laughs> Damn. Um, I need something to, you know, put pressure. Oh, this is good <laughs> pressure. <laughs> more pressure. I, how could you possibly put more pressure, Dave? Uh, <laughs> like uh, uh, <laughs> children. I, yeah, oh, yeah. I wasn't thinking about children. I was no! thinking of wound reflection, actually. Oh, uh, uh, no. That's even worse. But I can get children. <laughs> it's here. <laughs> Who let Davy do this? Who's in charge of Davy? <laughs> this deck is villainous. <laughs> I mean, but it it has no no one removed anything. You know, it, I That's kept true. everything. That is true. 
That's fair. Uh, My deck has not been functioning, I will say that. Yes, well, you've you've lost stuff. Been unfortunate. You know? That's I, I didn't lose anything, so that doesn't help. Oh, I could get the dread dogo. That's my favorite. That's my. Fa we were talking about dog earlier, so I think I'm gonna get the dread dogo and cast it. Because we were talking about it, and I like the dread dogo. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna use. Uh, oh yeah, this came up two here, and then I'm gonna use five. And play the Dread Dogo. So ETB I mill three. So Siphon Mine, Commander's Plate, and the Swap. This goes up here. Uh, I'm not gonna use... Oh, well. No. Uh, I'm gonna extort it, though. So y'all lose one and I gain two. Okay. And uh, the rest of my mana is gonna fizzle. Yeah, the rest of my mana is gonna fizzle. Um. Uh, yeah. <laughs> that, 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 that's it. That, that's 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 it. That's um, it. That's all. <laughs> that's all. Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> no, no, don't be. All, 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 all the good black cards. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, that's true. At my end step, I put the cards in my put the cards in your hand on the bottom of your library and in any order, then draw oh, the right. cards. I forgot about that. One, two, three, four, five. Uh so put these on the bottom. I'm wheeling all my removal that I was keeping for for <laughs> response to people murdering me. Good. One, two, three, four, five. <laughs> And I'm drawing lands, God. Great. <laughs> All right, so upkeep. I will draw two and lose six. Yes. And then I will draw one and lose, lose two. two. Okay. All right. This is fine. <laughs> yeah, this is okay. fine. Okay. Everything's good. Um. Oh, that's a card. <laughs> That's not a card I need now, but it is a card. Uh, <laughs> okay, I'm going to do what I said. I'm gonna I'm gonna try and go down with a bit of a show. I'm gonna go play a swamp for turn. I'm going to. Uh oh, that's an option. Is it? No. Probably not. Five, six, seven, eight. Oh, I will have enough. Yeah, sure. Okay. We'll we'll do that one. I'm gonna get two from that and black and play a marauding blight priest. Yes. Whenever I gain life, each opponent loses one life. Nice. Oh, that's gonna get me a blood token off Anya. Mm -hmm. Then one, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah, that seems like a good number. I'm going to tap for two, three. Hang on. <laughs> three, four, five, and black. Did I miscount my mana? You have the, uh, the fractured power stone. Yeah, I still did miscount my mana. That's fine. Doesn't matter. I'm good. I'm going to play in Olivia's Wrath. Each non-vampire creature gets minus X, minus X until end of turn, where X is the number of vampires I control. Currently, that is six. Hmm. Oh. Okay. Yes. I think you die. <laughs> yes. Do I die? Oh, to Conrad? <laughs> <Not> Conrad. <laughs> <laughs> well, you know what? I'm going to do it anyway because other people will take damage from it, and that seems like the most fun way to go out. Because I'm not going to do much else, honestly. Uh, so all my creatures are going to die. So we have to count the dead, the Sir Conrad. Yeah. Yeah, we'll have to count. All right. So One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. I have seven creature dying. Okay, I have four. So I'm taking 11. So I'm super dead. Uh, no, because, oh, yeah, 11. <laughs> Because we don't count the Sir Conrad. Don't so count, 1, yeah. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. And then you, Yogg, whenever a creature dies, uh, you also you lose uh, 11. Oh. Because of Dreadhound. 
Oh no, did I just king make Davy? <laughs> I mean, my whole board is wiped though, so I will have to rebuild and honestly my my hand's not that great. <laughs> so we'll see. We'll see. <laughs> Uh, yeah, but everything dies, though, so there is, a Kaboom. Savon is gone. Uh, the, uh, also the Fade Unraveler is gone. Um, I only keep, uh, Karik because he's, uh, he's a 9-9. Only a 9-9 to get through there, that's yeah, okay. 9 like, Only. You know, that's fine. Nothing bad. So well, you, there is still the underworld dream. So whenever you draw a card, you uh, you lose life. Oh, so it's my turn now. Because oh yeah, yeah that's it for me. I uh, I died it. to my own board wipe. Um, so I don't lose any ridiculous life. I just lose one from drawing normally. Correct. Yes. Yes. Okay. You're correct. I don't know what what can I do to save my soul. All oh, right, and also you will have to plane chase. I'll try to plane chase out because you will have to wheel your hand at exactly. the end step. That is correct. Yes. Okay. All right. All right. I, I might I might have something cooking here in the in the kitchen. Um, we, we like kitchen cooking. Uh, I'm gonna tap. It's the ideal place to do it. It is. <laughs> Let's have three. Let me play a devilish valet. That's a good card. Okay. So then let's see. My my short here on mana. I think I am. Just short. There's the battlefield under your control. Oh, nice. Okay, okay. Three, four, five, six. So Raphael now costs no money. Um, but I can still do this. This could be fun. Mm, kind of need that life link. Doesn't really matter. You have Kirk. All right. Well, we'll just try this. Um, we'll recast Sir Conrad, or uh, not Sir Conrad, Raphael. Um, that'll kick off Devilish Valet, making it a. Um, it's going to be. A, it looks like the trigger will probably. Oh no! Because it'll enter the battlefield. It'll be two. It'll be four. It'll be a four something four four there. But you have a nine something. Yes, I have a nine nine. With lifelink. With lifelink. Oh yes. my god. Yeah. And then if I wheel, I'm gonna lose everything here. And then lose five or six. Ah, okay, okay. Uh I guess I'll attack you with the devilish ballet. I, I will block. Okay, so I will gain four. I'll to... gain nine. Um, I will get a devil at end step, and I will have to wheel. One, two, three, four, five, six. You put them on the bottom of your library. Okay. And then I will lose... Oops. And I'll lose six, and I think I'm pretty much dead. We'll see. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. And your turn, Davy. <laughs> Let's see what I draw because that wheel was not kind to me. That draw, oh boy. <laughs> okay, um, we're gonna play as well, and uh, we're gonna um, we're gonna tap the uh, next lotus for five. Five. Realistically, uh, I should have just rolled the die, but <laughs> six. Yes, uh, I'm gonna recast Saison. He costs one less because of the Jet Medallion. Um, this guy gets up here, so the trigger is now back. So at your upkeep, 
You draw, t you lose three and draw two. Mm -hmm. And then the only non land card in my hand is Liliana's Caress. So. <laughs> <laughs> So whenever you discard a car, you you lose two life, and I will uh, go to end step and put all these lands on the bottom of my deck and draw four. All right. Oof. What do you got, Yak? What do I got? <laughs> Make a break here now. So I draw two, and then I draw one and lose total of three. You lose that? No, you lose. Four no, total because four. at your upkeep you lose three, draw two. Right. Oh no, wait, you no, it's more because more. it's one per card. One so per it's... card. So, so two, that's four, and then it's you lose four and then you draw you draw one and lose one. So I'm at four. Okay. I will play this blood fill caves, which will net me one life. Yeah. Yeah, it might make the difference. Maybe not life link, enough. baby. <laughs> um. <laughs> yeah, proxy. I'm, yeah, yeah. There's a lot of. I, I drew the right cards and and. <laughs> I, I Went to the wrong planes. <laughs> Yes, the planes were kind to me. Uh, <laughs> I think there was no planes that negatively impacted my game this entire time. I'll tap my power stone for a soul ring. Heck yeah. Love to see it. Mm -hmm. Turn 10 soul ring. Yeah, yeah, it's pretty late in the game, right? One, yeah. two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I have eight lands on the field. No, oh, just about. Six, seven, eight, nine. Yogg's got nine. So yeah, we're pretty much turn nine, ten, around this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. I have eleven potential mana here. Manas. Manas. Okay, so one, two. Four, five, six. Is that gonna work? Yeah, that work. Bob Mixilis unshackled. Oh, that's a good boy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. My favorite Bob. Um, we will tap one for a Rakdos Crackler. Ooh. And then I will tap four. To play a demon lord of Ashmouth, sacrificing the crackler. Okay, uh, so your 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 dude gets bigger. Yes, uh, Obnix gets bigger. Anything else happen there? No. I don't have but, any flyers. If you want to swing with uh, your uh, your that's commander, that's true. Raphael could swing in, so I will swing in with Raphael. All right, um, take four. For sure. Unfortunately, Raphael does not have lifelink. Really? No. Oh, it does not? Oh, it's other... Oh. Yeah. Um, Silly. I'll roll the plan or die. We'll see if I die at the end of turn here. No! Wow. <laughs> well, uh, you probably don't have five cards in hand. I have four. So you four have four. So don't die yet. So I go down <laughs> to one. One, two, Three, four. Love it. <laughs> okay. Is it, it's my turn now? Okay. Oh, yeah. Yep. One tap, a draw two, lose two, draw one. I oh, I drew another... gigs! I'm going to play gigs and then I'm going to pass the turn. And <laughs> Yes. And I'll die. <laughs> yes. I'm just going to play gigs. <laughs> Just because I wanted to play gigs. Good game. Good game. <laughs> Good game. Uh, so that's that's what happens when uh, a bunch of reverse crats decks <laughs> decide to fight each other. <laughs> yes. Yes. The one... Everything is shenanigans. Full shenanigans. The one thing is they were all doing different things. 
<laughs> yeah, they were all slightly different, all just doing their own little drains. You know, like, little drain here, little drain there. <laughs> I'm going to drain you for doing this. I'm going to drain you for doing this. <laughs> A lot of triggers to keep track of. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Excellent. Ooh. Excellent. I assume well, GG, everybody. This will probably just be the only game. <laughs> oh, yes. Yeah, I, yeah, I got to work tomorrow. Yeah. I just shuffled Raphael back into my deck. Like a fool. Oh, like no! A, like Come a on! Will I do that? <laughs> I think by now I'd be used to this. Do you even play Magic, y'all? Do you even play Magic? often I do that? Well, <laughs> why, why, why don't you... I think you skipped it. But why don't you sleeve him uh, in another sleeve? That would be wise. That, see, that's like, what, baby, that would be the wise thing to do. Different is color sleeves <laughs> is, uh, is my way to go because I would never think about uh, not shuffling my commander in my deck. Oh, I do you it know? all the time. And the only time so, I don't uh, do it if if I'm streaming, but if I'm like playing normally with people, just like in <laughs> real life. My commanders are always just shuffled into my decks, and I'm like, <laughs> I don't even put the commander out, and we've already started the game, or like two turns in, and I'm like, oh, I don't I'm going to cast my commander. Wait, where is it? Where is oh, it? no, it's in my deck. Oh, oh man. <laughs> just playing it at a disadvantage, I'm handicapping yeah. myself for the... Just putting my commander in here. <laughs> because if uh, otherwise, I'd be too powerful for you. You just tell them that. Exactly. <laughs> this deck is just too powerful, so the commander has to be in the deck. <laughs> I... <laughs> uh, oh my god. So we, we went a couple places. We went to like six places. That's yeah, that's pretty one. good. I don't, yeah. yeah. More than the last we time traveled. I did Chase. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I've only had like one time where we only went like two places. <laughs> oh. And it was... Yeah, it was too nice of a place, so nobody wanted to leave. Like, <laughs> you're like, eh. I mean, I, I didn't want to leave. <laughs> yeah, like, we had a bunch of doubling going on the last time I was on. Oh, that yeah. was crazy. <laughs> but we just kept going to different ones that would double different things. I'm like, no, stop it. <laughs> uh, my favorite plane is the goat plane, though. I just like to make goats. <laughs> goats. goats. Uh, and then I found this goblin that if. If you steal somebody, like, it's a stupid red spell that steals somebody's creature, but if you steal a goat, it gets, like, plus two, plus two. <laughs> it's like weirdly specific. Yeah, it's very specifically says if it's a goat. I was like, that's really super weird. <laughs> it seems like an uncard. Yeah, I was like, how do I turn my opponent's creatures into goats so I can get this <laughs> get this buff? I just want this to happen. I mean, oh, uh, yeah. I don't know, right? I was thinking maybe with masculine nexus. Right? <laughs> yeah, uh, I don't know. Because if someone has a masculine nexus on the field, uh, oh, it technically a it's a goat. Success. Yeah, if I have a masculine nexus out, when I take their creature, it'll become a goat. It uh, also become a goat. Yes, masculine nexus <laughs> is a uh, bait. Is bait. Goat tribal. I'm trying to just try to kill other people's creatures by turning them into goats. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, well, I'm going to let everybody outro themselves while I go find us a place to raid. And Mitch, you want to let us know where we can find you, what you got going on? And yeah. Uh, and go uh, thank you very much for having me. Thank you, audience, for hanging out and watching us play. Um, you, uh, I am Mitch Completed. You can find me on Twitter at Mitch Completed. That's... That's kind of it. I just do Twitter things. One of these days I might start streaming myself, but as of right now, I'm just enjoying guesting on other people's streams. So you'll find me all over the place here and there. But yeah, that's all for me. Thank you very much for joining me. Oh, of course. A pleasure. <laughs> Let's see here. Yog, what is happening? Yeah, I've been, uh, I'm Yog, and you're Yog Goth on Twitter and Twitch, and thanks so much, Mara. It's always so yes. much a pleasure playing on your stream. Uh, now I have my very own uh, fractured power stone here. I'm just going to keep pushing that joke for as long as I can uh, <laughs> and run it into the ground. Uh, but, uh, yeah, yeah, everyone can find me on Twitter. That's where I, that's where I be. I be there. Um, <laughs> thanks again. Good old bird app. <laughs> yes. Davey, what is happening? Uh, hi, I'm Davey. Uh, I am... Uh... Probably, um, Amara's worst nightmare. 
<laughs> You're a pleasure. My my dex uh, haunts her in her dreams, and she's like, "Oh no, Mummy Davy's gonna murder yeah, me!" I'm just gonna get uh, hit by frogs and giant. Oh yes, drawing frogs cards. and I like, don't want to draw cards. <laughs> But if you uh, if you uh, if you enjoy what you have seen tonight, uh, I also do stream on on Twitch uh, on Mondays and Fridays. I I I am I mean I already had uh, Imara on my yes. channel as well, and it's always been a blast. Um, so that's pretty much what I have going on. But uh, my partner Neil Royal, I'll drop his uh, his Twitter here. Uh, he's on a, a new endeavor uh, of his, which is making sick proxies. And these are oh, that's uh, your partner that made those. Yes, and these are uh, some uh, um, some triumphs that he made with uh, Monster Hunter uh, Rise pictures. Um, so directly from the game, and so he made those. Uh, there's a mana symbol that are from um, uh, that are a commission from um, Clover Altar, and uh, so he's uh, currently making those. Um, so, uh, you can follow him and his endeavors on his Twitter. He hit 900 followers yesterday on Twitter, and I'm just so proud. Mm. I'm so happy about it. Uh, so I wanted to share his awesome work. Um, so, uh, we did just invest in a cricket. Awesome. So we're gonna make some, uh, probably some etch foilings or some kind of stuff. I don't really know, um, What's gonna happen with that? But if we're gonna get it Sunday, so you're gonna get some pictures on that on Twitter for sure. <laughs> but that's pretty much what I what I wanted to share on this uh, on this yeah. closing uh, closing yeah. intro. Yeah. Clo uh, uh, anyway, no, words <laughs> so good. <laughs> words words do be hard sometimes. Oh that, yeah, yeah. Thank you all for joining me. It's always a pleasure. I always enjoy having you all. <laughs> Always know I'm going to have a good time. Um, I am Amara, goddess of plunder. You can find me here on Wednesdays and Fridays and <laughs> Saturdays. I'll be back on Friday at 11 p.m., I think. That sounds right. That sounds, <laughs> that sounds like something that was going on. <laughs> I know. I, I was sitting there I was like, let's see what a time everybody else is streaming. So I, did it. I try to stagger myself so I don't get in the way of other people. <laughs> I try. <laughs> But anyway, uh, thank you everybody for joining me. I am going to head over. We're going to go over to Astral's Flame. Oh, nice. yes. Nice. Cool, cool. Yeah. Go see Sean. Yeah. All right. So we are going to right over there. I just spelled everything correctly. Look at that. I'm on, mm -hmm. I'm on fire. Wow. Today, Damn. <laughs> <laughs> thank you for joining us. Everybody have a good night. Later. Bye, bye. Talk to y'all later. <laughs>